to show you how to rig up a stovetop smoker using things you probably already have in your kitchen. A big pot, a steamer insert, and a bunch of foil. To start, put a piece of tin foil in the bottom of the pot and sprinkle it with a few tablespoons of wood shavings. I use the kind put out by the company Cameron's. I like to use oak or maple for chicken and pork and something a little bit milder like an alder wood for salmon. Next, you're going to put another layer of tin foil on top and put in your steamer insert, as flat as it will go, and then add your chicken or fish or pork ribs, whatever you're cooking. You don't want to cram the meat in too tightly because you want the smoke to circulate around. Then put the lid on top and then scrunch aluminum foil around the top of the lid. You don't want any smoke to escape. We're going to smoke on high heat for about five minutes until it starts smoking. Then we're going to reduce the heat to medium, medium, low and smoke for about 10 to 15 minutes for small cuts like chicken or fish fillets and about 30 or 40 minutes for larger cuts like a pork shoulder which will then have to finish cooking in the oven. Once you shut off the heat, you want to let the food stay in the smoker for about 10 minutes or so. Then you're going to remove the foil and voila! If the meat is cooked all the way through, you can go ahead and eat it right now. If not, you can transfer it to a sheet pan and crisp it up in the oven under the broiler. Either way, it's delicious. For more recipes and tips, go to sever.com.